YouTube. Hi Saints. All right, this is the finished product right here. This is my milk stand, very temporary. I put it up in about 45 minutes. I put the uh, tarps on and I've used zip ties to hold them in place. It's quick and easy to do. Um, they don't cost a lot of money and it's not meant to be permanent. We put a, a bow in these houses and uh, set them far enough that I can stand up inside and bring my goat in here, get her up on the milk stand and milk her. It's not guaranteed that I'll stay completely dry, but I'll be out of the worst of the weather. And I do have other gear like a hat and a coat that I'll wear if it is raining and cold. The other thing is we can't tell um, which direction the wind is going to be blowing from when the storm comes. Right now it's blowing right in my face and so it's blowing right through this thing. But sometimes it comes from the north, uh, the uh, south and the west. And so it will be hitting this shelter on that corner over there. And so I would bring the milk stand farther in this way, farther east, to avoid the rain coming in that side. And we thought about and, and tried putting a tarp up here, but the wind is blowing so strong it was just bowing it out like a sail. So it wasn't going to work. But here it is, cheap, easy. Uh, the tarps were $8 a piece. The fence panels were $16 a piece. And the dog clips that I used that I showed you at the beginning of the video were $2 a piece. And I already had the chain, but you don't have to use chain. I used, if you can see down here, uh, string from, from bales of hay for part of the sec securing the, uh, the uh, fence panel. So it doesn't have to be expensive. It's easy to put up. You can make it more structurally sound if you want to do something more permanent with something like this. But for a quick um, shelter, it, it works pretty good, and I recommend it. All right. See you later, YouTube.